Well folks, I picked up a uh, wind turbine off of eBay. It's a used one. It's got uh, 13 blades. As you can see it comes with the tail fin, the PMA, some parts. I'm uh, just going through the parts now. Just uh, Actually I only found a couple. One bolt that's a little too long. So, we have to find a replacement for that one. Actually comes with a uh, voltage regulator too, which is pretty good. So I'm going to uh, slap this thing together, see what kind of output, and I'll be posting some more as I go along and put all the pieces together. Next step is to go out, once I get it together, just go out and get a pole, something I can prop this thing up high enough to catch the wind. Yellow PMA, not really happy with the color of it, but again, we'll change it. Now this is supposed to be a 1600 watt unit. Um, again, not entirely sure as it was used. Supposedly reconditioned, so I will uh, again put it up there, do some testing. See what I can get uh, out of it for uh, power. Well, we've got some of the blades on there now. One thing you have to remember when you're putting blades on is to make sure you put them on the right way. Of course, this one here I just stuck on backwards, so I'm going to have to take that back off again. I guess the red tips did help, except for when I hit this one. So, that one comes off, gets flipped upside down, and we're back to the other half. Okay, so I got all the blades on there now, torqued down to five foot-pounds. As you can see, it's a pretty good size. I've got the ruler laid out here. You can see this is up to two feet. So we've got at least a four foot, over a four foot wingspan, I guess you'd say. So next we're going to be into uh, mounting this on the PMA and mounting the PMA to the bracket. 